What's up guys, this is your boy Bernardo from the BTN HD and if this is your first time checking me out, make sure to hit that subscribe button and get the latest and greatest on Lenovo products. Today is all about configuring the iPhone device to Lenovo's Mirage camera. So let's get started. So the first thing that we need to do is get inside the App Store. And once you're inside your App Store, we're gonna click on Search. And within the search box right here, we're gonna type in VR 180. Click on it. There should be only one app because this is Google's app. They're the ones that developed the Daydream uh, feature. And I already downloaded already within my iPad and my additional iPhones at home. So I'm gonna click on the little cloud to re-download it again on this particular machine. Once that's done, we are going to click on Open. It's gonna open the app. It's gonna say, Welcome to VR 180. Manage your VR 180 photos and videos right from your phone. We're going to agree. Uh, and it's going to say, let's get you set up. So we're definitely going to enable the photo and video management. And we're going to click on next. And the VR 180 will like to access your photos. We're going to click OK on that one. It's searching for a camera. All right, so the VR 180 couldn't find the camera because it's not turned on. So we're going to turn it on, uh, pressing the power button right next to the shutter button. So we're going to click on it and hold it. It's going to turn green. The shutter button is going to turn green. Eventually, you're going to hear that nice little beautiful sound, and it's going to turn blue. Once that happens, that means it is completely started up. Uh, it will make a sound and light up when it's powered on. Okay, so we're going to click on next on that. Searching for the camera. Let's see what happens. Now it says connect your camera to connect. Hold down the camera's shutter button until it starts flashing. So we're going to click on the shutter button, and we're going to hold it until it starts flashing boom cameras found it turns green and blue looks like it's giving me some issues so let's try again search for the camera found it but it looks like it dropped off okay so i'm going to press the shutter button again okay i don't have to do it it just found it so it says press the camera shutter button once all set cameras connected and ready to use we're going to click ok and that's it Ah, awesome. One of the things that I complained during the unboxing and first impressions, it did not have an indication of the battery or how much space I have within the internal storage. Uh, but right here with the app, it tells me that. Uh, let's click on the photo. Let's click on connect. Definitely, let's connect. Uh, yeah, yeah, let's join. Please wait. Please wait for the Wi-Fi configuration to be set. This takes up to a minute. Wow. All right. There it goes. It looks like we're connected. And I'm going to turn it to these guys right here. How awesome is that? <laughs> so let's take a photo. Let's switch it over to video. Awesome. It looks like on the back part right here, it looks like it switched. So I do photo. It goes up to photo. If I go to video, it switches video so it's a slight little delay when you're switching over between photo and video and like I mentioned during the unboxing slash first impressions the only way that you could control the live feature is with the app which is pretty awesome so I'm gonna do a little video this is pretty awesome uh, huh, awesome cool 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 so let's go back cool Overall, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed this uh, video, how to set up your Lenovo Mirage camera using the VR180 app. If you have any questions or comments, leave them right below. Don't forget about hitting that like button, and i catch you guys on the next one. Peace out.